Hello and welcome back to another reaction. I'm AD Knox and today I'm watching Point Break. So you guys mentioned a while ago that you wanted me to watch this movie, but um, I'm finally getting to it and I don't really know what to expect from it other than the fact that Keanu Reeves is in it. I think there's like surfing or something involved. Yeah, I think I saw surfing or people in, near the water in the poster. So yeah, I'm interested in seeing what this movie's about, whether it's gonna be super action packed or if it's gonna be more of a drama. Other than that, yeah, I don't really know anything about this movie, so I'm prepared to be surprised and hopefully amazed <laughs> so yeah let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this movie and without further ado let's get into it oh I didn't know Catherine Bigelow directed this movie interesting oh I like the conversion that's really interesting guess two people are gonna be colliding or something I don't know Okay, so this looks like a nice summer oriented movie. Get me ready for my beach days. <laughs> it's an interesting contrast between the, the smoothness of the waves and the, the harshness of him shooting. And their worlds are gonna collide somehow, I guess. Maybe he's gonna solve like a murder or something on the beach. It's gonna be like a Baywatch thing. <laughs> I like to make sure that all my people maintain Coming sound through. cardiovascular fitness. We don't drink and we sure as hell don't smoke. Sir, I take the skin off chicken. Good man. This is us. All right. Bank robbery. And you are now in the bank robbery capital of the world. Bank robbery. Okay. Do you know how we nail the bad guys, Utah? By crunching data. Good crime scene work, good lab work, and most importantly, good data-based analysis. Special Agent Utah, are you receiving my signal? Zero distortion, sir. <laughs> I love these things. I love Keanu Reeves. He's so adorable in this. What I don't know is how, how you got yourself assigned out here to Los Angeles with us. I guess we just must have ourselves an asshole shortage, huh? Okay, here we go. Someone's a little jelly. Pappas. Yeah. Here, put on a blindfold. I want to see you to retrieve at least two bricks off the bottom. <laughs> Gary Busey. You know, I've never actually seen him in anything like serious. Just like reality TV and I guess entourage. <laughs> Little hand says it's time to rock and roll. Everybody freeze! Nobody move! Your what are those masks? U.S. presidents? I think I recognize like two of them. Time, Mr. Carter! 60! LBJ! We're styling! Huckart Nancy on the line! Woo! <laughs> 80. Air Force One is waiting, Mr. President. You know, this kind of reminds me of Sugar and Spice, because one of them had the Reagan mask on. Love that movie. Please don't forget to vote! I'm not a crook! <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, so uncalled for, man. I mean, I'm sure someone will recognize that ass. Just asking to get caught. <laughs> We're talking about solid professionals. Good moves. Yeah, they control the room well. Solid professionals that like to show that ass. I don't know. Doesn't sound very professional to me. Surgical. Look at them separate the die pack. Dick and Ronnie know their jobs. How yeah, the ex-presidents are the best I've ever seen, ever. Really? I guess you haven't seen very many movies, man. If you couldn't crack it with all your years of experience, it's impossible to conceive that I might have something to offer, right? Well, maybe I can do better than some over-the-hill burnout. <laughs> Watch your mouth. Just take some early retirement right now. Damn. And get some rent-a-cop night security job. Bold. <laughs> you want to nail the bank robbers and be a big hero, then here it is. The ex-presidents are surfers. Hmm. Surfers. Where did that come from, though? It's in our face. Look at the tan line on this mm. guy. Oh, well, he must be a surfer. Showing his ass, man. No bueno. The dates on these robberies. It's strictly a summer job for these idiots. They're traveling on the money, going where the waves are. <laughs> the ex-presidents rip off banks to finance their endless summer. <laughs> Time to go to the beach. Why can't I just walk around with this thing under my arm and act stone, ask a few questions? It's not sus. Two guys in suits just carrying surfboards like they don't know what they're doing. Is he drowning? Is someone gonna save him? Just kind of expecting a hand to come down. Oh. Good man. This pig boy piece of shit! You got no business out here whatsoever! It's kind of rude. Maybe he just wanted to learn. The name's Johnny Utah. Who cares? Yeah, they're totally gonna be a thing. <laughs> nice setup, guys.
Just creepily watching her get dressed. All right. I know who this movie was made for. <laughs> I'm going to learn to surf or break my neck. What is it? You all of a sudden got this bug that you just have to go surfing? So I'm a big hero to my folks, right? But two years ago, they were killed in a car wreck. I can't imagine it. And I suddenly realized that all my goals had been their goals, and I hadn't been living my own life. So I wanted something for myself. I want to do what you do. Uh, it's the truth. Yeah, but like, what happens when you fall for her and she finds out that you're full of shit? Like, you literally just lied about your entire life and you're totally gonna fall in love with her. You have to land on the board at the same time. That's it, that's it. You're surfing. <laughs> This is great, watching him like fall and have fun with it too. Having this little montage of him learning, getting in with the cool kids. He's doing it, I'm so proud of you. That's Bodhi, they call him the Bodhisattva. Wow, that's skill right there. Just like one with the wave, it's incredible. go to the beach this looks like so much fun he's totally going to become friends with them and he's going to have to take them down it's going to be all this like crazy shit happening like you're having way too much fun to take them to jail right <laughs> not cool it's johnny utah the ohio state fuck guys all conference remember oh, nice to meet you jesus christ man i knew i knew you it was the rose bowl three years ago you beat sc right you did this yeah that was one hell of a game interesting <laughs> Didn't get caught, technically. Because nowadays, all you have to do is look someone up online and just be like, oh, well, that's a cop, fuck him. <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> this is not some job flipping burgers at the local drive-in. Yes, the surfboard bothers me. Yes, your approach to this whole goddamn case bothers me. And yes, you bother me! <laughs> He's just mad that he can't go surfing. <laughs> Sorry, dude, can't be a part of the party. You're uninvited. Over the last two weeks, you two have produced exactly squat, during which time, the ex-presidents have robbed two more banks! Does either one of you have anything even remotely interesting to tell me? Dude, he is so jelly. <laughs> the beaches are always being closed because of waste spills, right? Yeah. And surfers are territorial. They stick mostly to certain breaks. Mm. If we can get some hair samples and get a match at a certain beach, we'd know which break the ex-presidents surf. Maybe just test the water and see if it has any of those pollutants? No. But let's do it anyway. It will bug the shit out of Harp. <laughs> yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> hey, when you two are done making out, I need to talk to you. Making a wig for my girlfriend. Thank you. Pretty sure that's illegal. <laughs> like, wait, are you serious? Was that like a thing in the 90s? Got it! Hey. Ugh. fucking air, man. Saved your life, bro. Close one. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, bruh. <laughs> Good looking out. The percentages look right. Hmm. Here's a match. It's a match. Gotta go beach. Nice point break. Long workable rides. Tubular, dude. I don't know. What do surfers say nowadays? Definitely not 90s jargon. Or maybe they do. I don't know. If you're a surfer, comment below. Let me know. Teach me your ways. Dude. I feel like he did that on purpose. Dude. Come on, man. What is it? Watch where the fuck you're going. <laughs> Jeez. Politeness. Oh my god. It reminds me of the time that I was on the bunny hill when I was going snowboarding and I accidentally ran into like a four-year-old kid. My bad. I was inexperienced. She was so much better than me. <laughs> um, ew. What is happening? What's with people watching people shower and take off their clothes? This is where you tell me all about how locals rule and yuppie insects like me shouldn't be surfing the break and all that, right? <laughs> nope. That would be a waste of time. <laughs> okay. We're just gonna fuck you up. So these are the bank robbers, clearly, right? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Strong. Broke my surfboard. I'm gonna fuck you up now. 
Yeah, get him, Keanu. Come on. Oh, come on. What the hell? You don't beat someone up for being bad at surfing. You just teach them. Oh, my goodness. I'm actually really glad you found me. Yeah? Why? Yeah, get him, Swayze. Got those moves, though. Kick is brutal. Yeah, I need you to run a plate for me. Two, Denver, four, Sam, Niner, five, Niner, late 70s G. I feel like it's pretty early in the movie to catch the guys, though. Like, what more can you do? What more is there to this? Felony B and E. Three months in juvie. Felony assault. Postgraduate work at Chino. These guys really fit the profile. Hmm. Maybe those that fit the profile aren't actually the ones, though. Maybe it's the ones that he actually befriends. <laughs> What are these parties? Oh my god. I've been to some wild parties in my day, but it's having the time of their lives, man. Big wave riding some macho assholes with a death wish. No, it's not. It's the ultimate rush. There's nothing that comes close to it. Not even sex. Maybe that's because you're not doing it right, Roach. <laughs> I wasn't going to say it, but... <laughs> okay, Johnny, this one's got your number on it. Let's jam. Paddle. Go, boy, jam. Shit. Die now. Fucking die now! <laughs> Don't manifest it, dude. Like, believe in yourself. Come on, you got this. Yay, he did it! Hell yeah. I fucking suck, man! <laughs> He's so cute. <laughs> if I didn't know better, I'd say you looked almost happy. <laughs> this is the point where he's fully embraced his role. He's really enjoying it. Goosebumps. Yeah, it's yeah. Come here. Aww, they like each other. <laughs> it's so freeing to just fall asleep on the beach. Sand gets literally everywhere, though. No sexy time there for me. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh shit! Aww, he feels so free and light now. Love it. I'm really late. <laughs> he comes back for more kisses. Aww, love him. What the fuck? Get the gun. someone at the front door now. There's just a person at the front door. Uh, have you seen my dog? I got a little dog I'm missing. It's a cockapoo-like thing. He's got his nose. Your fucking dog. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, these guys are bad news. The fuck? Going down, man. This ain't right. Shut the fuck out, man. Will you shut the fuck up? I mean, there's no way they would have known that it was a cop thingy-majig, you know? The fuck are they bringing out Tommy guns and shit? Like, that's an antique, man. You should put that, like, up on your wall. <laughs> Well, is there anybody, there anybody else around else here seeing it? Get the fuck out of my face! FBI, gorgeous. <gasps> oh my god! He just like shot at the woman too! Are you kidding me? <laughs> this is insane! Fucking pigs! What? Okay, and you gotta have someone in the shower. Like, what is the watching people shower stuff? Come on. Oh my god, that was a good shot, but holy fuck, man. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> this woman is completely naked. What is she doing? <laughs> like, put something on, lady. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ah. What the? <laughs> this is like naked woman. What is she doing? <laughs> Holy crap! This is insane. <laughs> what the hell? <gasps> oh my god! Please don't do anything with the lawnmower. <gasps> oh no! <clears throat> no! 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 Don't do it! Don't do it! 
No, his face is too pretty. Mm, so close. Oh my god. And Gary just shoots the freaking lawnmower. That works. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh man, that was suspenseful. So intense. You know what this is, punk? There's two keys. Uncut. Crystal meth. Oh, shit. I'd like you to meet Agent Dietz. Works for the DEA. Oh, no. DEA. They aren't the bank robbers. They're drug dealers. Damn. Saw these guys robbing Tarzana City National Bank on August 2nd when they were in Fort fucking Lauderdale. It's not an easy thing to do, is it, you two? Mm. Fucking jerks. I mean, they caught bad guys, just different types of bad guys. Can't be mad at them for that, can you? I don't know. So let's go. Time's a-wasting. Now. All right, back to the beach. See who the baddies are. It's funny, I knew, I mean, I knew it was a little too early for them to catch the bad guys. Like, what else would there have been? And now we know why. Mm. There's the ass guy. Got him. It's time for lunch. Angelo, it's 10.30. Right around that corner, there is a sandwich shop. Best I've ever tasted. Would you go get me two? Thank you. Hi, how you doing? Hi. Can I have two meatball sandwiches, a tuna on wheat, and two lemonades, please? Okay, that's two meatballs, one tuna on wheat, two lemonades. That's oh my god, come on. Ugh. So frustrating. People are not paying attention. You had one job. They're gonna be so mad at themselves when they realize. <laughs> Literally right there. Fucking A. It's like always be aware of your surroundings. This isn't the first time you've done this, <laughs> you know? God damn. FBI! Thank you. Fuck! He isn't worried they're gonna like recognize him or anything? Punch it, punch it, punch it! Oh, man. Can they call for backup or something? Like, what are they doing? There's two people in the car. One of you could call somebody. I mean, I guess I know that they're like in the heat of the moment, but you're trained for this, you know? Oh, man. That's insane, man. That's so frustrating. I mean, they had to have been in that place for a good like 10 minutes or so, maybe 15. Oh my God. Oh my god, that's like beyond dangerous. You could blow up the entire gas station with that. And yourself. Irresponsible. Here we go. The big reveal. The chase. It's on, bitch. Oh, and then that happens. <laughs> he just like yeeted the dog. Jeez, poor guy. <laughs> Jeez, dude. Shoot. Do it. Oh, man. He's probably thinking, he's my friend. He took me to cool parties and he taught me how to surf. Womp womp. I want you to know something. When you shoot, you don't miss. I missed. Bruh, you can't be mad at him. You're the one that was looking at a damn comic once you once they were going in there. It's your freaking fault. Blaming someone else for your mistakes. I mean, he chased him for like six miles. Like, he did something. And all this does is up the stakes of the game. Fuck the stakes, Pody! I mean, the only person this is a game to is you, man. This is real. This was never about money for us. It was about us against the system. We stand for something. We show them that the human spirit is still alive. That's why they do it? It's a little lame. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> like, don't you have better things to do? <laughs> like, come on. After the 30th one, it's like, all right, on to the next thing. A liar! Oh my god. You lied to me. I'll bet you lied about everything. Um, I'll bet you lied about your parents. You just tell me the truth, Johnny. 
Jeez, I mean, I knew she'd be upset, but I didn't realize she'd do something like this. Is everyone from the beach freaking unhinged? Isn't the beach supposed to make you like super peaceful? Maybe I shouldn't go to the beach this summer. <laughs> so come on, we're rolling. What's going on, buddy? Oh my God. I don't think I want to surf right now. Surf? No, this is different, Johnny. This is really different. Oh shit, they're gonna like try to bring him into their operation to see if he does something. It's like the ultimate test. Are you one of us or are you one of them? Ever done this before? No, nope. but I've seen it on TV. But listen, I sort of screwed my knee up yesterday. I noticed you limping, but hey, don't worry about it, Brad. Don't worry at all because we're not gonna land on land. Oh, well, fine then. I feel so much better. I don't know if I trust it. Is that parachute actually in there? Maybe it'll like grab one of them and hitch a ride. Who packed my chute? I did what? <laughs> you don't trust me? You gotta earn trust. Okay, we'll earn it together. Here, take mine. Probably knew he was gonna say that. Nah, you don't want this one, man. This one's set for a neck breaker. He's probably better off something like this. <laughs> gonna jump or jerk off. <laughs> That's my man. There you go. Ultimate test. Oh my god, that's insane. Such an adrenaline rush. I've never done it and free falling isn't my thing, but it seems really cool. <laughs> I love it. He's having the time of his life. It really does look peaceful, but that's until you have the threat of losing your life and going splat on the ground. <laughs> He's so adorable. Keep coming. It's almost as if he's like forgotten that they're a bit of a threat. It's just in the moment. How do you like it, Johnny? Amazing! <laughs> Fucking amazing! It's very beautiful. I'm just a little worried for him. Dude! You're so close. Pull the rip card now! You first! Pull it! Son of a bitch! Oh, okay. Scared me for a second, man. Don't do that to me. Interesting. So they're like really just trying to befriend him. I feel like that's such a California thing to do. It's like, nah, man, it's chill. He's a cop, but he's one of us. <laughs> no worries. Johnny, come here. There's something you need to see. Hey. What are they trying to show them the moment of his life before they kill him or something? This is an insurance policy. It will sting a bit, but uh, it's for your own growth, bro. Press play. Oh, man. Come on. Well, now. Got no choice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it, man. Think. Think it through, man. I'm the only one that knows where she is. You call him uh, right now. Tell him to let her go. Uh, sorry, I, I can't do it, bro. And where they're going, there are no phones, so you are shit out of luck. Motherfucker. I thought he was cool. I hate violence. Don't you see that's why I need Rosie? I could never do that, man. I could never hold a knife to Tyler's throat. She was my woman. We shared time. It's like the biggest mixed signals I've ever seen, dude. <laughs> Make up your mind. <laughs> but when three o'clock comes, you will gut her like a pig and try not to get any on his shoes and there's nothing I can do about it unless I get there. So I guess that makes us partners because we both have the same goal, to get me where I need to go, right? We're wasting time. Oh, that's what I love about you, Johnny. You are just as sharp as a razor. It's basic dog psychology. If you scare them and get them peeing down their leg, they submit. Yet if you project weakness, you draw aggression, that's how people get hurt. Fear causes hesitation. And hesitation will cause your worst fears to come true. So it's simple. Project strength to avoid conflict. Peace through superior firepower. <laughs> Wow, that's a nerve to be waxing poetic while he's doing all this fucked up shit. Like, are you kidding me, dude? Like, yes, I agree, but like, who are you? <laughs> Jeez. Everybody freeze! <laughs> okay, on the floor, now! Right now! On the floor, asshole! What's your problem? 
I blow out your fucking kneecap. Oh my god, he's not even wearing a mask. Not even a black mask or anything. Didn't even try to cover his face. That's interesting. Maybe they'll see the footage and be like, okay, he's obviously in distress and can't do anything about it. I don't know. How do you explain that? Would you be a deer and open the gate for my associate now? Mr. Duggan's got the keys. We never go to the vault. Just do it. Lyndon, go with him. We're hitting the vault, man. Go, go. Going extreme for the last time. Don't you dare try to do anything heroic, dude. Stop. Don't. There's too many of them. There's too many people. It's fucking security. Like, <laughs> no offense, but... Oh, this guy's gonna get everybody killed. <gasps> oh, shit. Shit. Oh my god. Oh, ah, motherfuckers getting people killed. Holy shit, wait. They had it in them. Big mistake, dude. Huge. Hmm. And it's like, I don't know if I should feel bad for them, but I kind of do. Because they were like, fun. Okay, but what happens to his girlfriend? Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. If you so desire, an attorney will be provided for you free of cost. Now, do you understand these rights I've just given you, Utah? I was having so much fun with this. Fuck this guy. I was in this bureau when you were still popping zits on your funny face. Is that right, Pappas? Yes, that's right, Harp. And there's one thing that I learned out of all these years that you still haven't got. Yeah? Why don't you astonish me, shitface? <laughs> <laughs> that was satisfying. <laughs> I know where they're going. I figured you did. Knew it! They're gonna go for it. They're gonna find him. Oh, shit. I know you, man. When they fall on you, you won't back down. They'll have to burn your ass to the ground. Tell me where she is, and I walk away. That is beautiful, Johnny. No! Jeez. They're killing everybody in this movie. Oh my god. No! Get out of the way, kid! Damn it! <gasps> oh, damn. Come on, no! Gary! Oh, fuck. Oh, come on, man. Jeez. Oh, Gotta kill the partner. Well, you're gonna ride this all the way, Johnny. You and me, so let's go. Hmm. Get the fuck up, Tyler's weight! I mean, your body count is way too high now. They've got you. Wherever you go, like he said, it's all over for you. We'll pop up on their screens. Doesn't matter. We're almost there. Just gotta get you to a safe jump altitude. And okay, let's get your rig on. Jeez, now he's gotta jump with his bullets in his chest. <laughs> No, 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 no. Oh. Oh. Throw me that money bag. Now! Jeez, like, was it worth it, dude? One last time? Oh my god, he's gonna, like, die in the air and then fall, and then people are gonna be like, what's this dead guy parachuting for? <laughs> Tell him to release Tyler. Do it! Do it now! You won, you got what you wanted! Cancel the order! She served her purpose! Do it, man! You owe me that much! What the fuck? Oh my god, okay. This motherfucker. I know it's hard for you, Johnny. I know you want me so bad it's like ass in your mouth, but not this time. Mm -hmm. He's gonna jump out of the plane and get him. I bet. I bet. He's gonna jump on him and get into his shirt. <laughs> He's doing it, yes! Oh, fuck yes! <laughs> this is amazing! <laughs> Doesn't even know it's coming. Won't even know it hit him. Jesus, that's bold. So badass. But like, what's the plan also? 
Yes! God, he's just like, well, it is what it is. <laughs> oh my God, uh, Johnny, at least put it in your pocket or something or in between you, like, you know, on your chest, in your stomach. Ouch. Imagine if they'd hit the rock instead. Mm. I'm out of here, Johnny. You're gonna find the gun? You're gonna shoot him? And me again, huh? Too bad. Looks like this time you won't be getting your man. Second time you said that. Don't underestimate him, man. Of course, she has to be in a nightgown. <laughs> like male gaze or what? <laughs> Daddy, I. Some other time. How can you love him? Cause like, he, he lied to you and you don't know anything about him. And it's been like three weeks. <laughs> I'll see you in the next life. I think he's gonna see you sooner than that, dog. It's not over. We can't leave him here, we gotta bury him. Uh. Damn, they just left the friend there too. Didn't even take him. His hair is long now. Interesting. This has been a while later. Definitely playing the long game. I see you. He's over here having an existential moment. <laughs> Jeez. Too bad. Finally get your way because it's totally closed out. Just waiting for my set. You crossed the line and people trusted you and they died. <laughs> yeah, it went bad. But real bad. Life sure has a sick sense of humor, doesn't it? Still surfing? Every day. We're gonna go for one last surf in the rain. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Look, what is he gonna do? He's all alone. No backup. No jurisdiction. I'm gonna like drown him or something. Johnny! Wait! No! No! <laughs> nice. So smart. I told them you go quietly. Yes, get it. There's the backup. He knows what's up. Look at it! This is a once in a lifetime opportunity, man. Just let me go out there. Let me get one wave before you take me. My whole life has been about this moment, Johnny. Come on, compadre. Come on. Think he's stupid? Come on. <laughs> Don't do it, Johnny. Come on! He doesn't deserve it. What? Okay. Come on, dude. There's no way. Well, okay, well, he's clearly gonna surf and then like jump off and just so that he's not caged, right? You let him go. No, I didn't. He's gonna die because that wave is way too big. We'll get him when he comes back in. He's not coming back. Wow, I mean, <laughs> I guess it does come full circle. Very poetic way to go, riding that last wave. Doing what you love. Didn't even get a chance. It's not like they can pump the ocean to find his body or anything. I mean, come on though. You should have just let him rot in jail. Like, don't give him what he wants. Is it just leaving the FBI now? Oh my God, I have so many questions. <laughs> 
this was freaking awesome oh my god thank you to everyone who told me that i should watch this movie because holy crap i had no idea what to expect this was such an adrenaline rush throughout the entire movie at first you think this one group of guys is a part of the scheme but it turns out that the guys that actually like befriended him are and you think that they're cool and everything like that but then they end up being freaking whack jobs and it's crazy patrick swayze and his awesome like you know fight moves as well his form is absolutely incredible watching everyone just like enjoying and being passionate about the beach and being passionate about the waves and everything and riding also hearing him talk about you know the the existential things while also doing these horrible things as well and being a part of that aspect of it i also um definitely called that keanu reeves would fall in love with a chick obviously that happened but um yeah it was interesting seeing that whole dynamic because then she was used as like the damsel in distress and he had to go save her but then the way that he had to do it you know the tests that they made him do in order to actually save her him jumping out of the plane and everything it was just like oh man this was so sick Ugh, even like that moment when they were in the house doing the raid and just all these crazy things were happening this naked ladies like stabbing people and shit like <laughs> what is this movie i definitely wasn't expecting any of this but i had so much freaking fun watching this movie i definitely want to watch more keanu reeves movies i've only seen a couple like you know i've seen the john wick movies which are some of my favorite action movies i've seen um speed which i watched on this channel and like a couple other things like the lake house but let me know if you want me to watch any other Keanu Reeves movies because yeah I'm trying to think of any others that I haven't seen but yeah check out my letterbox and see if I haven't watched a movie because then I'll just put it on my list of movies to watch but yeah I was just like pumped up for this entire movie Patrick Swayze and Keanu Reeves together brilliant brilliant absolutely brilliant I had so much fun with this movie I'm still kind of just like what the flip also oh my god so Keanu Reeves is an FBI special agent at 25 years old that's actually pretty incredible like super young and then also at the end it looks like he's just given it up so I mean regardless of whatever happened throughout this entire thing they clearly had an effect on him like with their philosophies and things like that happening or maybe it was just like him being close Close to the girl and just like you know figuring out that he doesn't want to do this anymore because he actually got close to them somewhat as well like maybe there's some sort of psychological thing happening where he's like I can't do this anymore because I got too close to them or something like that you know but definitely want to watch more movies like this so please give me recommendations in the comments below and whew, I'll see you in the next one <laughs>